always thought that one of the things that sets Camp Cedarbrook apart, makes it unique, is the way that it's based on small groups. The small group is at the core of your life at Camp Cedarbrook. You become part of a family that's your cabin or tent group. That counselor leads that group of eight girls, and you eat meals together around a table um, that you're served family style. You sleep in the same cabin group. You have devotions in the evening, your Bible acts during the day. You spend time doing an activity together every day. That small group family is what your camp experience is based on. That's why it's easy to come in and not have any friends and find that you have friends really quickly because you're there in that small group. Um, It's why you walk away feeling so connected to your counselor because you spent that time with her just like you would in a family. And that's what small group is about. Being there for a whole week allows these small group families to develop in a special way that doesn't happen elsewhere. The 24-7 nature of camp is really conducive to a small group deepening and strengthening. I think in the area of spiritual growth, camp uses small groups to all its advantage. Rather than focusing on large group chapel services, the core of the Bible study and discipleship happens in Bible exploration, which is a time when that small group family sits together and looks into God's Word. And... um, It's a special time because the girls have the chance to interact with God's Word, not just take it in, but listen, share, learn from each other, learn from their counselor, and work together. And I think that is why kids walk away from camp and they've learned something that goes in deep and that they remember because of that learning they did in the context of relationship. I have the opportunity now to um, head up the children's ministry at my church, and I think a lot about small groups here. And I think that's one of the greatest things that we do as a church is provide small groups for children on Sunday morning. The reality is we all need to connect with other people. God made us to be in community. He made us to learn with each other and from each other. And that is best going to happen when you are in a smaller group. It works for me as an adult in the growth group in my church that I'm in. It works for our kids here at church being in a small group with a consistent leader. And it's what makes camp so special as well. And I think camp was onto this long before we sort of snagged onto this as churches and realized how special it was for kids. When I send my daughters to camp, there is um, just confidence in knowing that when they get there they will be absorbed into this new little family that's forming that week and that they will be there um, growing together and watching out for each other.